snubbed Prince Harry settles for dinner with city financier Guy Monson after his father told him he was too busy to see him during UK visit. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Prince Harry will meet a millionaire financier after he admitted King Charles was too busy to meet him in what experts described as a snub that reflects the depth of their rift. The Duke of Sussex arrived in the UK alone today after flying from California to attend a ceremony to mark the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games in London tomorrow. Before the service, Harry visited the Armoury House this afternoon to attend an Invictus Games discussion entitled Realizing a Global Community hosted by Louise Minchin. But Harry's spokesman said today, in response to the numerous inquiries and ongoing speculation about whether or not the Duke will meet his father while in the UK this week, this will unfortunately not be possible due to His Majesty's full programme. The Duke of course understands his father's notes of commitments and various other priorities and hopes to see him soon. Instead, as confirmed by the Duke Archul Foundation, he will meet city financier Guy Monson. Reacting to the news, royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams said, this, whatever the logistics, will be widely viewed as a snub. This is one of the most public controversies in the world. If this issue was dealt with privately without too much press speculation, it would have a better chance of being resolved. Royal expert Michael Cole agreed. He said, it is extremely disrespectful. That the king will not see his youngest son, Prince Harry, even though the two men will be only two miles apart tomorrow afternoon, gives an indication of the depth of the division. The prodigal son is not welcome, not at the present time, anyway. Royally, this is great medicine. Prince Harry must see it for what it is, the clearest possible indication of the harm that has been done. There can be no mistake, this is a royal flea in the ear of fifth in line to the throne. Actions have consequences, but rarely are they carried out as blatantly as they are here. Even Prince Harry, who was never the sharpest sword in the household cavalry, must have gotten the message and a lot of people will be saying, it's about time too. Fellow royal expert Richard Palmer said, it is surprising if the King and Harry don't meet at all, and perhaps a sign of how much bridge building still needs to be done. There was a lot of media speculation that father and son would meet. And while this always seemed like a guess, I believed they would meet too. It is understood Harry had various commitments at the Invictus Games today, according to ITV. Monson, chief investment officer at Saracen and Partners, an £18 billion London-based investment fund, was alongside the Warring Brothers when they unveiled a statue of their mother Princess Diana in 2021 at Kensington Palace. It was Harry and William's last solo engagement together. He was the former treasurer of the Cambridge and Sussex Joint Foundation before Harry and Meghan resigned as senior royals and emigrated. Tomorrow, the Duke is due to give a reading at a Thanksgiving Mass at St. Paul's Cathedral to mark a decade since the inaugural competition in London in 2014. Organisers said there was no confirmation that any other members of the royal family would attend, or whether Harry's wife Meghan Markle or his children Archie and Lilibet would also be in the UK. Thanks for watching, please don't forget to subscribe. See you in our next video.